Um, so just real quickly about me, why I say um, Priscilla the pilot. Um, I graduated from Riggins High School uh, down south, still in District 7 area. It covers essentially from Riggins up to Sandpoint. And I graduated from Riggins, went to the Air Force Academy, um, ended up becoming an A-10 fighter pilot. Probably, I'm just going to make up numbers here, probably the only female fighter pilot to come from District 7. I'm not sure. But um, really uh, enjoyed serving my country. I got off active duty two summers ago, joined the Guard down in Boise. And right now I'm actually a major in Air Force Reserves still, but because it's a reserve duty, I was able to get involved in politics. I have a servant's heart, and I really want to help locally. Um, I realized flying about a 1,000 combat hours in Afghanistan that here we are trying to protect the freedoms of the people in Afghanistan while we're losing our freedom right here. And that just really tore at my heartstrings. So that's why I wanted to get involved. District 7 and all of Idaho needs a stronger voice to really fight for our freedoms. Because like she said, freedoms aren't free. So that being said, um, some additional things I can talk about. I have um, some flyers in the back um, at the table. My biggest, my biggest points that I kind of tell everybody that I stand for, it's God, it's family, it's country, and it's Idaho. In that order, every time. God, family, country, Idaho. Sorry, I will speak up. Is that better? Great. And um, some additional things. I'll share a quick little story. Um, my mother's family is actually from Texas. And my grandmother grew up in Texas, and it was about World War II when um, we, they attacked Pearl Harbor. And she went over to California to help build boats and planes. And she literally put the rivets on the boats and the planes while the guys were out fighting the war. And it's really cool to think that my grandma was Rosie the Riveter. <laughs> and it's funny because I didn't really realize that until I got older. And, um, but I had the Rosie the Riveter, you know, we can do it thing in my room, college dorm and pilot training uh, room. Because we can do it. But three things um, she taught me. To so educate yourself. And don't ever let school get in the way of your education. And to work hard. And, um, and that we can do it. Have that positive attitude. And so with that, we can do it. Fight for our freedoms. Keep educating our children. And um, I brought the Idaho State Constitution. If you have questions on that. I brought our U.S. Constitution. The Republican platform stuff. So... We are ready for your questions. Um, we have, I have um, several handouts in the back too that dive into the numbers, and I'm really looking forward to um, sharing those concepts with you. Thank you for letting me be here, and. Uh